Our um, usual bear bird dog. <coughs> you have our usual bird dog back and forth with the hand and knee on the ground. We then jump up to a bit of a bear position. Try and go back and forth that way. But if that's a little too much of a demand, you want, we want to play with our bases of support a little bit. When I get up in here, I'm kind of on my hands. So I got a little extra tricep, a little extra, um, little extra variables as far as what pressures across the palm. So if that's too small of a base to kind of get that rotational control as I go back and forth, we can regress more of a medial elbow. Uh, it gets a little more, re uh, like a little more uh, down the developmental pathway, like a little more reflex stimmy with that pressure anyway across the inside elbow. So we can go on a slightly elevated surface. Fixation point. It's going to be more uh, meat of a condyl inside meat of the forearm. So under here, we're going to raise up into it, and then we can go into the motion to see if we can tune a little bit more into our midsection. And also, one of the most important parts is our stance size glute. As we go each way and tie a little extra of our quad and hip flexor into it, we can use this as a regression and a bit of a stepping stone, building up into our full version as we go back and forth. 